right, I'll be teaching us how to trade on text lab so let's start with this trade dot text lab dot space take note that's it trade dot text lab dot space launch it now when you launch it to make it easy for you uh, it will load as if you are you are running it on phone and that will not be too good it will make the trading easy and smooth so run it as if you are loading it from um how do i put this uh from desktop so like you are running from your computer so use desktop view desktop mode or desktop site it depends on the browser you are using so after the loading is completed then let's look around for where we are going to trade okay so no now let's see for example let's see let's see now we have a, the token that is currently trading now i'm coming uh, what's the name dxl you can see it here dxl that's dex lab itself okay let me connect my wallet let's start from there connect my wallet i use solet so I have done this to be automatic so I will need to be typing my password again so now it's connected now you are you can see we are on Dex lab that's why I say my Dex lab balance and so on now let's take a look at this you let me say okay you must have your USDC in your balance that's it I have it one dollar here so we have two kinds of usdc so should in case you you are seeing zero meanwhile you have a usdc and you are sure it, we have two kinds so you just click here see the two let me select the first one for you you see it's showing me 0, 0.00 that's it this first one but the second one i'll go back there you see showing it one dollar so we have two usdc take note of that so let's move on you scroll down so this is it you click on this to see list of all tokens you can see it from here too but this one is showing the all test tokens not all so you have to click it to show me a list all right we have those lists like that to save your time where are you going so for example i want to buy woof w o o f Oh, so we have baby wolf now so i'm going to wolf is the one under i click it i leave it to load it sometimes it will hang as if it's not loading so you can hide this so it's already there wolf usdc so let's go and check the chart you see how it's fearing i think it has dumped okay still pumping can you see the see the chart <laughs> that's that's interesting see and that's cool all right let's go to the buying and the selling aspect now so you scroll let me let me let me do this so you scroll you look at this we have buy here and we have sell here if you are selling you click on sell you see it's blue button now sell you can see if you are buying you click on buy so you see you can see buy there now now we have the grains the grains represent those who want to sell no sorry who wants to buy okay while the red represent those who want to sell in some exchange it is other way around but let's just follow with this let's follow suit here red means those are selling you can see them these are their prices and the quantity they want to sell so pick the one under the last one that's the cheapest because look at this three seven six two zero look at this three seven seven you see seven seven is more than three seven six so you pick the one lowest so you select it pam oh it has disappeared somebody has picked the other you see there is still buy prayer so the price price is pumping somebody has bought it so if they buy this one too before i i take action i will lose the price another price will be there it has it has disappeared you see how it's changing so i select this i select this how do you know it has okay once i select it how do you know it has been selected you will see it here 
you see it here so let me go again uh, this thing is not waiting for me people are just picking it picking it let me see okay ah, pumping okay it's thumping now okay so four seven you see it here now all right i'll now decide on the amount i want to buy let me just take the amount here let me buy twenty dollars two zero is the price still there oh it has gone down so abby yeah it has increased again if i buy it at this price it will not the trade will just be there hanging it will be under a uh, green so i'll be waiting until i see anybody that want to sell it to me and if i didn't see on time this is what we have on my trade will just be there hanging and even if the thing is pumping you just keep pumping except i scroll down to come and cancel it so i have to pick the one that is the lowest else i'm not going to be able to to buy i will just be among the ones waiting so i'm buying 20 dollars is the price still the same yeah it's good so let me now proceed with my buying buy wolf so i've clicked on but okay he said must be an increment of one oh i know the reason the reason behind that is because i don't have um enough solana let me teach you how to do that so that's that takes us to lesson two i, I, I now you can see how to buy but act, let me open this solana so let wallet so now see what i want to do I'm going to pick this up all right now this is what i want to do click look at this i'm going to click on this take note i'm going to click on this i tap it good now look at this top right many actually have a lot of soul eating i want to go and delete all the trades because one thing about solana is that when you are trading in a place it will secure some soul for you and an house it is to be like an house where your trade will, will will work on so you have to go and delete or close that trade see after clicking the you click on manage decks if you don't close it your your soul will just be hanging there so which means if many people discover this and they close their trades they will have a lot of soul More, some will be disappointed they will and they will be shocked i mean that they have up to one soul so i have to close it the reason why this joke is not closing is because it has rocked it has rocked it's a rocked token now no, no more in the market but this one is a recent trade i did so let me close it you will see now it will return back you see it's done it's going to return back so it won't go anymore because it's done so now it will return back my soul to me you see nine dollars it wasn't there before so let me let me let me let me run it this way uh, i don't know why it's not going let me refresh it I have already closed the trade so my my soul is returned let me run run it so when i refresh you like that i will need to uh, connect my wallet again so let me pick it up okay the reason why it's not it's failing is this okay i'm coming is because it it does not accept anything lesser than anything that is not a, 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 a multiple of zero it has to be multiple of zero so i'm buying 20 20 dollars so it has to be multiple of zero so i have to change it it's not it's, it will not allow 5321 is that is 5300 you see that that will go 5300 all right so i'm buying click on this then you stay the amount you want to buy let's say you're buying 20 dollars what all right now it does not allow you to buy anything that does not have a multiple of zero multiple of zero so this 5321 will not be accepted it's better you call it five three zero zero 
spell it that way. Five three zero zero. It has to end with I think two zeros or if not three. So we'll check that now. We'll know if this one didn't go. Then I have to turn it to five thousand instead of five thousand three hundred. Okay. I think it's connecting now. So I approve it. All right. Okay. Transaction sent. Transaction sent. Transaction confirmed. It's done. It's bought already. Now you see from it one dollar I have sixty one dollars. Now it has it has been bought. But one thing is you won't see it in the balance yet. Okay? You won't see it. Even if you check here, you won't see it. You won't see it there. Oof. You see, it's still showing three oof. So how do I now do it? You have to go and settle it. So come here, click on settle. Okay, done. It has done. So let's go back to woof. You see, it has refilled. So that's how it works anyway. So you can now go and close the trade so that you can have your soul back. Yes, that will be eating your soul space. So woof. I'm settling and I'm closing. Okay. So that's all. You have it back. So let's go and check balance. I'll see it there. Okay. Let it disappear. Let it disappear. Disappear. Okay. Alright. So you see nine dollars what is back no more three dollars that's how it goes